Hello everyone and thank you for coming back to the channel. That is Deb Snails 48 World. Hey y'all. Hey fam. We just gonna get into a little short video because I thought it was cute and I was like that is strange as hell. With that man making all that kind of money. But we're gonna be talking about Rock Dwayne Johnson. Y'all know what smelling was cooking. He was part of the wrestling phenom fem feminon or phenomenon when it was very much so a thing to be into. And he definitely um, transpired into acting and getting into a lot of um, heavyweight type of action-packed movies. And his body had to stay top-notch. You know, he's just like Arnold Schwarzenegger. They love to be in the gym. They love to pump those abs up. Very nice looking man. But he was saying he pee in a water bottle, y'all. And I was like, what the hell is he talking about? Why he don't just go to the bathroom like most, you know, adults do? And he was saying, and these are the type of water bottles I think he could be talking about. And I was like, I wonder how long how long does it hang? You know what I'm saying? The little penis, you put it in that bottle. And then, does it get on his penis? Because, you know, those water bottles, when you fill them up, when you got a lot of water in you, they might like, damn near fill up that whole thing if not run over. Okay, so I'm like, what kind of water bottle is he using? And that's kind of nasty. I know y'all know it's nasty. And I was like, okay, uh... All the money that he makes in the gym that he would probably be going to. I'm sure they have facilities. Because I know y'all been out there and y'all be out there working. Of course, we don't give a fuck. We know, we know, we know. All right. She just liked the man himself. All right. But I don't know if she liked Rock, uh, Dwayne Rock Johnson or not. But who couldn't like him? You know, he's nice looking. He has a nice looking physique. <laughs> okay. But don't know how he is in bed or whatever. But I'm sure... Hey, he had children, so somebody was uh, privy to that. But anyway, um, yeah, you could turn your nose up, Clara. I kind of find it a little distasteful, too. But I never heard of a gym not having facilities. Because I know I've been there before where I had to use the bathroom after working out. You know what I'm saying? Even if it would just go throw water on my face and just take a quick pee and then get on out of there and go home and freshen up and do what I had to do. But nine times out of ten, I was just getting in the car, going home, hitting the flow, and, and trying to relax for a few minutes before I hit the shower or take a bath because the, the the thing had wore me out. That's why I got me on my own gym. And I still don't have an excuse. I still don't go down there and exercise. <laughs> but that's me and, and my issues, and I'm, I'm not uh, putting myself on the platform today. Maybe later on. Maybe later on. But not today. But yeah, we. I just had to break this article. <coughs> The way Rock Jaws is talking about, he pee in a bottle, and he has a good excuse for why he does it. So let's get on into the article that Yahoo.com have brought out on this young man. Tom Beasley wrote the article about him. He titled it, Dwayne Johnson Explains Why He Pees in a Water Bottle. Okay? The gyms that I work out in don't have a bathroom. I'm like, what kind of Neanderthal type? organization you go to that work out are y'all all brutes and heels up in there y'all like tarzan in the jungle at least you could use behind a tree or a leaf or branch or something like that when you had to uh go use the bathroom out of sight from people but you talking about they don't have a uh, i mean how do the employees uh that uh be managing the gym and, and helping people work out by their personal trainers and stuff how do they use the bathroom maybe it's just not for members but it's for employees because i couldn't work nowhere they ain't got no bathroom i'm sorry i got to go you know i might get to run this one day or i might have that with good bowel movement because i ate some breakfast and stuff or hell i might just have to pay I ain't gonna say I was on my period because I don't experience periods anymore. But you know, you got to have those necessities, those facilities for that, and the toiletries. So I don't know what rock got going on, but it don't seem kosher to do it. But going back to the article, it says Dwayne Johnson has explained why he pees in water bottles at the gym, clarifying that he only uses water bottles that he won't ever use for water again. Well, I hope so. I hope so. It, it, you ain't even necessarily had to say that. Because uh, we just assuming you probably drunk your water and you use one of those uh, disposable water uh, bottles. Or maybe, you know, maybe you go a little higher and get you a little nice water bottle that, you know, keeps your um, your your liquids cool and stuff or high, however you see it. 
But yeah, that's why I put the water bottles out there because I don't know. But since he did kind of clarify, I guess it's one of those bottles uh, that you, you know, get from the store. And you drink all the water of, you know, Dasani or Fuji or, you know, just plain Kroger water, Publix water or, uh, you know, generic type water. that you just get out the faucet, I guess, and pour it in a bottle. That's the kind of water bottles he says, the re uh, the not reusable ones that you just throw away. You know, I say paper and plastic, you put them in the plastic, that type of deal. But I don't know, still, you paying it in, because they recycle those plastic bottles. So hopefully they really sanitize and clean it out, because you saying you sit up there and pee in a bottle, and then, you're like, hey, that ain't right. That ain't right, Rob, because you got people that go through garbage that's not fortunate like other people, and they live out of trash cans and stuff, just find empty food. Now, what if they thought? Your pee was uh, ginger ale or lemonade. Come on, Rock. You, you know what I'm saying? This is now, Rock. Go find you a new gym, brother. Go find you a new gym. But anyway, going back to the article, it says the Hollywood star usually habit, unusual habit, was first revealed in 2017 in an Instagram video in which a container of urine could be seen. Okay, in the video, he said, I don't have time to go to the bathroom. I find a bottle, I pee in it, and I keep training like a beast. Okay, well, I'm like, you need to, I'm sure your parents taught you better hygiene than this. You need to find you a gym. You need to go dispose of your urine in the proper place, right? You're not a kid. Okay, you're a grown-ass man. You know better. And you make too much money to be sitting up there like, I got to stay in the zone. Well, then maybe you don't need to be drinking no water. Go on there and get your good workout. You know, like I said, go to the restroom to release your bowels or to release your urine because you don't want no infection coming on. And then carry your behind home. That's the sanitary thing to do because, no, anything can happen. You know, like say, how you be, um, say you struck out on a cruise ship or whatever, or you're in a little dinghy and, you know, you need to be rescued. You're in the middle of the ocean or whatever. Some people have to drink that urine, man. Somebody have to drink that urine. So they might get misunderstood. Ah, this is nasty, Rob. What's going on? Um, he says he still wants to train like a beast, and you got time to go to the bathroom. So he looks, and I'm like, I hope it's, I hope it's just men in there, and I hope y'all not paying too much to, uh, y'all not paying attention too much to each other's penises and stuff, cause that, you know, I'm like, what kind of uh, place you go into, and y'all do these things. I don't think that you should be doing that in public evil. I mean, how do you go relieve yourself? You go around the corner or you just pull it out and, like, put it in the thing and go on about your bed? I'm, I'm, I'm thinking that equipment need to be wiped off, too. Because you, you're taking your, your, your penis, you're sticking it in a, a jar, and, you know, the, then you got to put the penis back up. And that's unsanitary, man. It's completely unsanitary. But anyway, going back. Um, that's my visual I was giving myself. Like, that's still nasty. You still touching the equipment. You got some wet ones around now that you forgot to mention in this article that you clean your hands out with. Man, men are just nasty. So, no, maybe rock. You just nasty. I don't know. Okay. I'm still caught. I'm still caught in between of it. But anyway, going back to the article, it says, but in a new interview with Esquire, Johnson said he wanted to give context to why he decides to relieve himself in the gym. He explains, is that, I mean, just come on now. Is that appropriate or is that something the gym allows you to do, Rock? But then going back, it says, he explained, it's not a water bottle that I've actually purchased solely for water that you wash and you clean when you are doing done using it. They are just bottles that i'm no longer using usually the gyms that i work out in don't have a bathroom because they're the iron paradise they're just hot sweaty and dirty so you're saying rock you go to one of those establishments and everybody just pulling out their penis peeing in bottles and shit like that and then they're going back touching the equipment that's nasty that's germ infection that's unsent that's just Woo! Rock, 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 rock. Okay, going off of that. In August, Johnson shared more insight into his hygiene habits, assuring fans that he takes three showers every single day in response to the celebrity discourse about infrequent bathing. Okay, he wrote, shower cold when I roll out of bed to get my day rolling, shower warm after I work out before work, shower hot after I get home from work. I'm like, the shower need to be hot every time you touch the shower, Rock. It don't need to be cold, medium, then hot. This ain't no cycling when you're washing clothes or something of that nature. We still want our clothes. I don't care if they is color clothes. We want them hot. 
Even though they tell y'all to wash y'all clothes in cold water with y'all colors, like the blues and the blacks and stuff like that. But I don't, that's your clothes ain't coming clean. If you ain't putting a little hot water to kill them germs, you forget about it. You, put them germs. You, you shouldn't even wash your clothes, really. You shouldn't even wash your clothes. This is how I feel. Every piece of garment that I throw in the washer, it has to be on hot. I'm sorry. I can turn my clothes inside out so it really don't be washing on the side that I need to stay colorful. But it's still getting a hot temperature. So, Rock, rock I don't know where you going with this. I wouldn't be telling people this either because it's kind of embarrassing to a certain degree. When you really sit down and analyze what you're saying. All right. But anyway, that's all I had for this video. I just couldn't believe Rob was talking about he was peeing in a water bottle. And then I was trying to dif differentiate which one was he talking about. The ones that you clean and, and disinfect and, and use for another time. Or was he just wh whipping out his penis just throwing it in one of them bottles that's uh, recyclable. And then I was thinking about the recyclingness to it. Because they recycle plastic. So it just did not seem kosher that you should be still doing that, Rob. And then you're telling everybody on social media. Man, do you wash your hands after you come from the bathroom? That's what I want to know. Do you wash your hands before you cook? I don't know. I don't know, Rob. I don't know. You're not looking good. You're looking good, but you're not looking good, favorable for hygiene. Once again, it's a question mark again, Rob. It's a question mark. But that's all I got for this video. Yeah, Kat, I was kind of confused, too. And Michael, you should have been confused, too, because you be, you wearing masks and all this stuff, trying to keep, you know, sanitized and all this different stuff. But I, I don't know what Rock got going on, but it's not it's not kosher to me. And in the days, uh, times we got going on with this over and all that, we need to properly hand wash and sanitize. Hand wash and sanitize. And with Rock going over here into these uh, gyms, y'all better not go to the one Rock go to, because he already telling you. He ain't practicing no good hygiene. And you touch them equipment right after he don't got them. You might catch some. I'm just saying. I'm just saying, y'all. But if y'all like my video, definitely share them out to your friends. Subscribe to the channel. And definitely like my videos, okay? But I will see y'all next video. Be breezy. Bye-bye.